the medical imaging industry is about to get a lot more real. New technologies coming to some hospitals and medical schools will allow doctors not only to see three-dimensional pictures, but to interact with them as if they were real. Using devices such as virtual reality viewers, as well as styluses or other hardware that provide tactile feedback, doctors will be able to take a tour of a patient's brain, for example, and even cut into virtual tissue. The technologies come in a variety of forms, from fully immersive virtual reality studios to simulations that use virtual reality viewers, such as the Rift headset from Oculus. General Electric is working with a handful of research hospitals on one version. Virtual reality technologies are a more immersive way to look at data and have the potential to more dramatically affect patient outcomes. In clinical trials, some virtual reality simulations reduced surgical planning time by 40% and increased surgical accuracy by 10%. Pediatric surgeons at Stanford University Medical Center have used a virtual reality platform from Silicon Valley startup EchoPixel to plan surgeries on newborns missing pulmonary arteries. It's a difficult surgery that requires precise mapping of pulmonary vessels, typically done using pen and paper. Using the technology, surgeons and radiologists were able to develop more accurate surgical plans in less time. One of the most promising uses of virtual reality may be in medical training. Universities that can't afford to store cadavers for teaching may be able to rely on virtual reality instead. Still, the high cost of implementation and other factors means widespread adoption of virtual reality technology is probably several years away.